don't just walk into Fimbleventer. We're going to have to be creative, love, if we're ever going to make it. Look over there. That's the Cathedral of Cascades. It was used for ritual worship of the mountain. Inside, there's a device that can build a bridge to the heavens. It will take us halfway up Fimbleventer. An express pass. Right, love? Seems something finally came to mind, little one. While you're in the remembering mood, you wouldn't happen to know where the entrance to Inferno is up there, would you? Inferno? You must be in some shit if you're volunteering to go there. Let me put it this way, love. Once we get to the mountain, you'll get your choice of going up or going down. Thimbleventer doesn't let you just stick around. And which way will you be going? Me? <sighs> What's the matter, little one? Scared of what comes next? Shut up! Just get me to the mountain! Little one! Get away from me! Welcome, this is Space Raptor for Space Raptor Gaming and I don't go out buy many full price games, I have got to be honest. Um, I maybe buy one a year and this is my one and it's really, really amazing. I, the last previous two years I, I got it wrong so badly that uh, it, it made me a bit wary. But this time I have got it so, so right. But I was hoping I had. I have been waiting for this game for at least two to three years since I played the original Bayonetta on the PS3, which I thought was an absolutely awesome game. I love the idea about her being not so good and fighting angels. Um, the, the art stylings I, I really loved. Um, and the gameplay was just absolutely perfection in a fighting game as far as I was concerned. I thought it was a really, really good game and I, I must have completed that six or seven times at least. So, I was hoping this was just going to be as good as Bayonetta, the first game. And I am pleased to announce, not only is it as good but it's actually topped the first game, which uh, I find quite amazing. The only thing I don't like um, about the game would be the fact that there was a puzzle element to the first game that really didn't make it into this game. And I, I'm sure they can't put everything in because it would make it muddier. But I would like to have seen that back. Because I don't think it would have compromised the fighting at all. In fact, it would have been a nice change of pace sometimes. But it's a small gripe. Um, the overall gameplay, I've already completed this game once and thoroughly, thoroughly enjoyed it. So, this is my, say, second time around it. And I just thought I'd put it on YouTube just so as I could show gameplay to people. The thing is, is not everybody's gone and bought a Wii U. Um, I kind of... The decision was made to get a Wii U in our house um, maybe about 12 months ago. And this was definitely a consideration within that choice. Because I really did want to play this game so badly. And I'm so glad that it hasn't disappointed me. So, yeah. As far as uh, that's concerned, I'm a I tell you how I feel about that though. I wish this game was on PS4, Xbox One, Xbox 360 and PS3 as well. I really would have liked to have seen everybody, everybody get a shot at this game. Because it's just scored 10s across the board from the reviewers. Not that I care too much about that. 
because I think there's a lot of corruption in video game reviewing. But, by and large, they seem to have got it right. Um, would I score it as high as a 10? Will 10 be in a perfect game? I don't think any game is perfect. And I've got to take half a point off it because the puzzle sections that I liked from the first game are not there. But, it has kind of uh, made improvements on the combat system, which are very, very fluid. So then I've got to give that point back. So, overall, do you know, I actually think they got the scoring right, there or thereabouts. Maybe a nine or a nine and a half, because I don't think any game is 100% perfect. But this game is so polished that we're, we're there or thereabouts to perfect game. There's not a lot. You see, if the gameplay mechanics are broken, you know, on a game like this, it would be broken game. They are polished within an inch of their lives, and I just love it. Oh, I just got it there, didn't I? Boo-hoo, it hit me. I quite like this level, it's nice and short. Um, it will keep my ramblings to a minimum. Um, please let me know in the comments below whether you prefer these videos to have commentary or no commentary. Whether you just really like to concentrate on the uh, gameplay element or whether you can actually do both at once. Concentrate on gameplay and listen to me battle on. But yeah, um, as far as should anybody buy this game, if you've got a Wii U, I'd say yeah, yeah, go for it, get this game. It is value for money, without a doubt. I can see myself playing this in the next two years to come. Not constantly, there will be other games in that two year period, but I own a large, I just think I'm just going to keep hammering and hammering and hammering away at this game. For at least two years. And let's face it, I'm kind of player that bought Halo, the original Halo game, and I still hammer away at it to this day. Was it 14, 15 years on now? And I, I'm still... I'm still playing away at that game. Love it to death. So I'm not the kind of person that, you know, plays a game for six months and then leaves it alone. Uh, I play games for a long, long time. So yeah, it was definitely worth its money. One of the gripes I've got in this country is uh, Bayonetta. Apparently, I do believe, comes packaged in America as part of the deal as part of the £40 or $60 deal but in this country they're charging an extra £20 for the original game which I'm sorry you can get it for £5 on an Xbox 360 or a PS3 why am I going to go and spend 20 quid on it because I've already played it and yet yeah, you know, maybe I would buy it back again because I don't have a PS3 anymore for the Xbox 360 but I'm certainly not spending £20 on it so I can see Bowser as a demon or something like that you know um, this is very little change to the game other than that anyway we've just completed our boss level here this is the Gates of Paradise Paradiso I hope you enjoyed it and I'm just going to leave you with a cutscene thank you very much see you again soon oh and I only got silver drop I don't recall asking for your permission. Oh, and I was wrong about our final destination. Going down. Fuck. The boy. I got 
about that. Oh. <laughs> 